since you saw me on youtube one week i think so your girl has been on a break but she's back so hi guys or welcome to my channel in case it's your very first time to be here as always remember to hit the subscribe button so give this video a thumbs up and for my returning subscribers as in i mean you actually come back to watch my videos cheers so um thank you so much for the support thank you for always being there as i remember we are on road to 2000 subscribers and this is going to be very possible if a thousand is thick and then 2000 is going to thicker yes so guys uh today's video is one of the most amazing video from the title guys we are growing up we are growing up we have grown up it's that time, you know, it's that time we start uh, living independently and um, get to feel how it feels to pay your bills, you know. That's what that means we have to hustle hard, you know. But anyways, guys, we have to do it and um, you may figure time, you may figure time and that is what we're going to do. From the title, guys, as you've all seen, uh, we're going to do a one-bedroom house tour. This is a house that I found while hunting for houses you know and i feel like why not share it looks so good maybe someone will be, be wanting the house you know and i'm not saying that i didn't want the house or i don't want the house i still need it but you know guys what do you look for when hunting for a house for me number one it has to have good lighting it's because guys i am a youtuber and good lighting as in natural you see natural lighting is just the first thing and then the second thing guys is it should have water 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 like a house without water mm -mm. no 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 and then the next thing guys to consider is a security for that place you know we all want a place where you come late night and uh, you don't have any fear of going to your home you know we all want that so comment in the comment section let me know what are those factors that you consider when looking for a house you know let's interact uh, people do when they go for house hunting they wear something because it's so hot let me tell you it's hot in Nairobi and so that is why I'm in this top but we are going to do it it's not easy so guys, without wasting much of your time or our time, we have a long day ahead of us. What it takes to look for a house in Nairobi, it's not easy. Imagine, so I'm just uh, walking and I'm house hunting guys. I'm looking for a one bedroom, if not a bed sitter. Guys, looking for a house in Nairobi is not easy at all. It's not easy. Second day, hunting for a house in Nairobi. It's not been easy, trust me. But today I'm lucky. I can say that. Guys, welcome to a one-bedroom house tour. So guys, I found this house and I can say, I can dare say that uh, this is the best house that someone would want to have, you know. And uh, so this is me entering the house and uh, the first thing that you spot or the first area that you see, it is this sitting room. So who doesn't want a large window? Like who doesn't want her sitting room to have a large window? Look at that window guys, look at that window. After the window, here we are, the roof. Look at that roof and look at that lighting, okay? I know you're seeing like there are so many colors in this house. We have the pink, we have the green, you know. But what happens in Nairobi is that you get to paint your house to the color you want, you know, that is allowed. 
guys the fact that the living room is actually spacious a credit is given we are done with the sitting room guys and now we are heading to other rooms and immediately this is what you see hi guys here comes our mirror our mirror our mirror and probably this guy is going to spend a lot of time looking at the mirror instead of recording the video ha <laughs> So guys, we are standing at the mirror point and on our right hand side, that is where you find the washroom and I love these walls. I love the walls. Honestly, you all can see that these walls should be given credit and I love how spacious it also is and yeah, we all want that. So this is where you put your tissue, uh, some extra storage and I think some towel, that's where you put it and uh, you put soap there. This is us getting out of the washroom and uh, we are going direct to that mirror and uh, as you all see these are place I think you put your hand wash and uh, the other side you also put maybe your um, this side now you put your towels or serviettes you know and of course this is a mirror and it has some light here and this light is just you can change it to any color that you want that's the best thing. And so not forgetting we have some light there just for the corridor, you know. Now that you've seen the sitting room, you've seen the washroom, guys, let's head to the bedroom. So this is the door to the bedroom. And you guys are not ready. You're not ready for this bedroom or oh, you're not ready. So here we come, we have entered. What, guys, look at this closet. Oh my good God. Okay, I've never seen a one bedroom with such a large or massive closet. I've never seen. Okay, and I'm not, I'm not kidding, but I've never seen. Imagine the storage, I mean, we all want storage. We don't want to like put our house to have so many things put together, you know. And uh, that is why we have or we need this closet just to make sure everything is just in its place. <laughs> Guys, I don't want to lie that I fall in love with this bedroom, honestly. And it's because of the closet. <laughs> yes, it is. You know, uh, I'm imagining myself, you know, not having so many things in my bedroom. And the only thing that I can see is just a bed. And all other things are just uh, organized in this closet, you know. And I just love it because of the space. As in, it's so huge. Imagine. So that is the other side. And we also have this other side where, like, it has some sections, as you see them. And there's so many. And, of course, the drawers you know the drawers drawers or drawers whatever guys but we all want these and uh, this is the best place i feel like for me in this house the bedroom closet is just the best thing you know it's not easy being in a house where you don't have a closet it's so hard Guys, the walls are pink, but you can repaint to the color that you want or you prefer. And another thing that I loved about this bedroom is the lighting. Lighting. And of course, it has the natural light, you know. Let me show you this natural light, you know, you see. And um, I love it because it's going to give me like a, a good space or a good lighting for my videos, you know. This is better unlike the sitting room, you see because it's direct to you, direct to the bedroom. I mean, this is the best thing. Guys, I've just noted that I haven't shown you like the tiles, the floor tiles of this house and um, here they are. What do you think? So guys, we are actually done with the bedroom. So far, I have shown you like the sitting room. 
I've shown you the washroom and I've shown you the bedroom, right? So right now what is remaining is the kitchen and the balcony. So kitchen lovers here we come and uh, this is the door for the kitchen like the door that leads you to the kitchen you know and look at those wall tiles look at them i mean i don't know there's something that i do love about wall tiles i don't know but i feel like it makes the house to be so i don't know to be to be so smart kinda studio and i can say for this kitchen it's not that um a big as i expected you know had those expectations i'm like oh the bedroom is big the sitting area is also big and so the kitchen will but oh my god it's not the case but i love the fact that it has enough like storage so this storage is going to like reduce the many things that may be around the house you know and uh that is i think the idea they used while building this house and yes guys so as you all see it has a lot of cabinets and um that is the best thing so this is the kitchen view this is the kitchen view okay so you're washing your utensils and that is the view okay and that is the sink so you see guys i told you it's not that big but we have some more storage down there you know enough storage for you that's the best thing for me that is the best thing guys remember to comment on the comment section like what do you consider when looking for a house okay what do you consider when looking or when hunting for a house comment let me know here i bring you the kitchen lights not that bad and immediately after that we head to the balcony okay the balcony is not also that big it's just like a small balcony that you can chill and have your fun time and enjoy your moments you know and yeah so guys i hope you are enjoying my video if you do remember to give the video a thumbs up muhimu also in case it's your very first time watching this video here we do amazing content. Please subscribe, turn on your notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. So that is it for this house uh, i have shown you like the sitting area bedroom kitchen washroom the balcony okay so that is like a full one bedroom house i hope you enjoyed guys i hope you did so guys this is a house that had the best uh, spacious rooms and of course water security thick but i did not settle on this house and uh, this is the reason I don't want to lie the bedroom had the best light but the sitting room guys mm -mm, mm -mm. because i had to like switch on the light for me to record this video so what you're seeing is the sitting room with my lights on and that is what i'm trying to avoid i want that natural light guys you all want that um super quality content and natural light is just the best and that is why i did not settle on this house that is to say guys i'm still house hunting i'm not limited to one bedroom i can also get a bed sitter so in case you have any links comment down below let us um help each other you know so i hope you enjoyed this video guys if you did remember to give the video a thumbs up and also comment in the comment section if you want to see other like houses that i'll be hunting you know i'll be recording for you just in case you need them